Hello, my Bemuse family, and welcome back to Bemusing Bill. This artist on today's episode, his name is, he calls himself Jelly Roll. That's a stage name. And I've heard his name mentioned before. Uh, I don't remember exactly the context. Probably someone else I was reacting to that people were like, at least a couple comments, uh, you should ought to check out Jelly Roll. So I saw Jelly Roll do an interview, partial, just a little clip on YouTube um, with Joe Rogan Experience. And he was talking about how he wants to help people and how uh, music has, has saved him. And, and I just really liked this guy. And I thought, you know, his message should be here on Bemusing Bill because that's what really all the artists that we have on this show are all about you know their music their artistry is 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 helping people and it's it's connecting with people and that's really what music is all about so i really liked hearing what he had to say um i know that he recently has been in a in front of a, a i guess a senate hearing uh, about fentanyl and saying and, and I'm not, I can't quote this exactly, right? But uh, it's something to the effect of, um, I used to be part of the problem when it came to distributing fentanyl or, you know, I guess whatever he was, he was doing. I used to be part of the problem, but as a man standing here before you, I want to be part of the solution. And, and I hear him talking about helping kids and these juvie facilities and he spent uh, uh, from 14 to, to 25 basically incarcerated, missed high school, got his GED at 23. You know, this is just stuff I'm, I'm catching from the, I think it was like two clips from, from Joe Rogan that uh, really endeared me to him. So my wife said, well, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to find something for you and I'll, I'll, I'll pull up a video. And she was in tears when she saw this one. So... I don't know if I even got any tissues around, but she's like, oh, you got to do this one. This one really hit home. So um, this is called Save Me, and this came out a few years ago, so this is not new. And I know he's got an, a, a new album. I think it came out like maybe eight or nine months ago or something. So hit me up in the comments section. I'm going to leave this link in the description box below. If you're new to the channel and like to support all those Links are in the description box as well if you want to join our Patreon community. And, and you know, we talk about artists like this. We share these experiences. We are musical lovers and appreciate so many indie, indie artists that have come out. And this man's story has really touched me. So I'm a metal dude. And this dude, from what I understand, country, rap, and I don't know. I don't know what else he does. I love that so many artists are so diverse these days. That brings me so much hope. And I was losing hope. This channel is only two months old, but I was losing hope in music until I started this channel uh, based on one artist who was independent and, and blew me away. And I've been blown away ever since by so many other amazing artists out there. So that being said, let me bring up this screen and hang out with uncle bill here and let's check out some jelly roll save me first time blind reaction checking this out let's do it one two three Drinking and smoking 
broken is hopeless but feel like it's all that I need Something inside of me is broken I hold on to anything that sets me free I'm a lost cause Baby, don't waste your time on me I'm so damaged beyond repair Life has shattered my hopes and my dreams I'm a lost cause Baby, don't waste your time on me I'm so damaged beyond repair Life has shattered my hopes and my dreams Now I see why it, it hit her so hard Wow His voice is out of this world. Yeah, this message is definitely, ah, oh, this life has shattered my dreams. You know how many people I know? I mean, everybody, practically, practically so many of us. Ah, oh, and I know it a little bit about his background too, so, man, I wouldn't even, I, I couldn't even imagine. I, 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 um, I couldn't imagine being incarcerated or, or you know, for from 14 to 25. Um, yeah. I used to work at a, a children's home for young boys. Uh, I ran the kitchen. And uh, there were a lot of young boys there that, uh, you know, it was, they were, they were, they were court appointed, you know. So many, but from working there, I I found out a couple of my friends had actually gone there, had actually been part of that themselves. Didn't know that because I met them, you know, when when we were in our late twenties or thirties or something, and mentioning it, it would bring them to tears. And and I know that Jelly Roll is trying to help those kids because he was in that spot, and man, his voice, and of course, if you were going to play in, in in a minor key. And that that's gonna hit you hard too, but man, I uh, this is so it's beautiful and so heartbreaking. Hopes in my dreams, I'm a lost cause. Baby, don't waste your time on me. I'm so damaged beyond repair. Life has shattered my hopes and my. Uh, 
Yo, tell me what you guys think, man, because my heart is heavy. Yeah, my heart is heavy. That's that's that life does that to so many people. I mean, if he was fourteen, what the? He said something about he did a crime that uh, he lives with his regret every single day and uh, and his shame. And uh, you know, you do stupid things. And he was a kid. How many of us have done stupid things? I mean, sure we. If you live a life, you know. Man, I, I'm just so, I am captivated, and this man has got a hell of a voice, and he's got a hell of a message. Definitely going to be part of this this channel here, so hit me up in the comments, tell me what you guys think of Jelly Roll, What you, if you're fans, let me know about this man. Um, I'd love to do more, I would, so hit me up with what you think I should do next. Um, live performances, studio performances, whatever, collaborations, whatever he's got. Uh, uh, wow. I am blown away. I really am. What a beautiful song. What a beautiful song. And I, I totally get why my wife was, was so upset, too. I mean, she's going through hell herself. She has been a, a chronic illness that has been, has ripped her life away, uh, five almost five years now she has not been able to do any damn thing and things you know she gets a, like a a break sometimes and and then everything comes crashing down again it's just a horrible situation and and i'm sure it hit her even harder because you know life does sometimes crush all your hopes and your dreams you know man so listen until next time be good to yourselves. Be good to each other. And I'm, I'm your Uncle Bill here. And I love you guys. So you take care. And until next time, I'll see you all later. Bye.